Amid White House efforts to dismiss Russia media hysteria, Jared Kushner adds 100 plus names to the FBI contact list. Guest post by Emma Jo Morris. Reports emerging that senior Trump advisor, his son-in-law, Jared Kushner, has added more than 100 names to his list of contacts made throughout the campaign and transition on his FBI clearance form. This news comes in the wake of the media firestorm surrounding Donald Trump Jr.'s meeting with Russian lawyer Natalia Veselnitskaya, which has dominated this week's news cycle. This move adds fuel to the media concocted fire that the Trump administration has been withholding information about Russian contacts. Since the April New York Times report that Jared Kushner failed to disclose his meeting with Russian banker and Putin confidant Sergei Gorkov, Kushner has updated his list of contacts submitted to the FBI three times, adding over 100 names, according to New Business Insider report. The Daily Mail reported earlier that Kushner kept a low profile at the Allen & Company conference in San, Sun Valley, which he and Ivanka attended today. Quote, Ivanka spent the better part of the, part of the break between sessions with her husband, however, who seemed to be avoiding the press and photographs by hiding behind a statue on the campus, Ivanka could be seen walking over to Jared while he looked to be having a stern conversation, end quote. This is what the Daily Mail reported. The news comes as questions swirl as to how the Times obtained knowledge of Junior's meeting with Veselnitskaya and more disturbingly how the Times received advanced copies of his emails. Who was giving the Donald Trump Jr. emails to the Times? That means if somebody hacked Donald Trump Jr.'s social media, obviously, Trump confident Roger Stone gave a lecture to a young Republicans gathering at the Capitol Hill Club earlier in the week. One participant pressed him on the identity of the leaker in this particular story, to which he finally conceded the individual's initials are JK, according to the Independent Review Journal. There are three senior level staffers with these initials. However, only one of those individuals was indisputably aware of that meeting. Kushner was present for the first part, although Junior mentioned in his Tuesday Hannity interview that Jared walked out after five to ten minutes of listening to Natalia Veselnitskaya and realizing the invitation to the gathering was deceptive. Quote, Goldstone sort of goosed up, he built up, there was some puffery to the email, perhaps to get the meeting to make it happen, in the end, there was probably some bait and switch about what it was really supposed to be about, end quote. This is what Donald Jr. told Sean Hannity, and he said, I think it became pretty apparent to Jared and Paul. I think Jared left after a few minutes. This would not be the first time since Trump's inauguration that Jared Kushner was accused of dubious behavior, as reports surfaced within the last few months of him leaking to MSNBC in an attempt to damage Steve Bannon. Kushner has included Natalia Veselnitskaya as one of a hundred other meeting details in his updated FBI list. Editor's note, a few details in this story were not verifiable, including the validity of Stone's allegation, of course. This is a building story and it will be updated as new facts emerge. This is on the Gateway Pundit.